In the early 2000s, a strange case appeared inside a Western intelligence agency. A case that embarrassed them so badly they almost buried it. Because the person who exposed their secret wasn't a rival country, but a teenager. He was 16, living in a normal home in a normal neighborhood. Teachers called him quiet, his classmates barely noticed him. But he spent hours online learning how networks worked, how data moved, and how governments protected their information. And one afternoon, while exploring public servers that anyone could access, he found something unusual. A small file sitting in the wrong place. A file that should never have been visible to the public. At first, he thought it was a mistake. But when he opened it, he realized he had stumbled into part of an internal communication system. Not passwords, not nuclear codes, but enough to prove that the agency's secure network wasn't secure at all. He didn't break in. He didn't hack. He simply noticed what the professionals overlooked. When the agency finally traced the digital footprints, they expected a foreign spy. Instead, they found a skinny 16-year-old sitting in front of a $200 second-hand computer. Agents showed up at his house, not to arrest him, but to ask him how he did it. And according to people who worked on the case, the moment he explained it, the room went quiet because they understood something frightening. If a kid could find this hole, a real enemy could too. The agency fixed the flaw. And later, they quietly offered him a path into cybersecurity work. It's a reminder of a simple truth. Sometimes, the world's biggest systems don't fall to power, but to a single young mind that pays attention.